A Holy Cross senior is researching nutrition in the city. Megan Hockey says some food pantries may not be supplying the right information to clients who use them. She's hoping to teach others how to make meals out of fresh produce some pantries offer. Our Gretchen LaRosa joins us in the studio with the story. Gretchen. Olivia, this Holy Cross senior says she wants to change the stigma of food pantries offering just canned foods while also offering healthy eating accessibility. As an anthropology major, Megan Hockey listens to a lot of conversations, but she says a topic not being discussed involves nutrition. Because food has been proven to help you in so many different ways with chronic illness and different diseases, and if you have a balanced diet, I think it can really help you down the line. As part of her summer research, she volunteers at AIDS Project Worcester. She says most clients at their food pantry are in a routine and take the same items every week. They just kind of hand stuff back that was fresh and I was like, why? Like, this is like awesome. This is coming from a garden right down the street. AIDS Project Worcester has a garden with fresh produce. They say the vegetables offer a different alternative to canned food. It really offers them an opportunity to kind of be a little bit more creative with the things that they're making and, you know, feel a little bit more connected directly to their community because it is grown right here. Professor Dana Harvey says the topic of nutrition has changed over the last few years. He says it's less about quantity of food and more about nutritional value. We're slowly beginning to have that conversation where it's more about culturally appropriate food uh, and it's more about nutrition uh, and it's more about just feeding people in your community. Hockey says she hopes her research will break nutrition stereotypes. If you're in these food insecure areas or you're struggling with food insecurity, you're more likely to have diabetes, heart disease, obesity rates all skyrocket. And that's happening right in Worcester. Now the food pantry at AIDS Project Worcester is open on Tuesdays with a nutritionist available. Megan Hockey says her final research will include not only Worcester, but several central mass communities. In the studio, Gretchen LaRosa, Worcester News Tonight.